Hey you guys, Sophia on Earth here and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm bringing you guys my second CVS haul of this week. Like I said, this haul is a little bit bigger than my first haul. In this haul, I used three accounts to do these deals, so let's get right into it. In the first transaction, I picked up two of the whole blends, four Colgates, two Crest, three Claro boxes, and two Hallmark items priced at $2.99 each. Now here are my coupons. I used a $4 coupon for two whole blends, I get two dollars dollar coupon for the Colgate and another two dollar coupon for the Colgate. Then I had a six off of two Claro Digital, four off of two Colgate, I get three off of two Little Care products for the Crest toothpaste, I get three dollar off of the other Claro, and a one dollar Crest toothpaste glitch. And then I had a six off of 30 purchase CRT in this account and a four off of 20 purchase CRT that I paired in because my total before coupons was around like 52 dollars so they both attached. And then I had a three off of three Claro hair CRT and then I had a three off of two Hallmark cards CRT. I had two of those. And then I had a three off of three nail or hair care CRT. And then I rolled $10 in extra bucks to lower my out of pocket. And my subtotal was $3.41 after the $10 extra buck. Alright, so I'm going to help you guys understand this transaction. So my total was $3.41 before coupons, but I did roll a $10 extra buck, which is $10 of my cash. So I'm going to go ahead and add that $10. So our actual total was $13.41. But you guys, for this transaction, I got back a total of $20 in extra care bucks. So first I got $3 in extra care bucks for the two Crest toothpaste. So we're going to go ahead and subtract that. Then I got a $5 extra care buck for purchasing two Claro. I'm going to subtract five. Then I got a $3 extra buck for purchasing two Garnier shampoos. So I'm going to subtract three. Then I got back $6 for the four Colgates. And because of the Garnier and the Claro Root touch up, my total hit over 30. I'm going to be getting $3 in beauty bucks within 48 hours. So I'm going to go ahead and subtract three. So the final cost for this transaction was completely free and a $6.59 money maker which is an amazing transaction to start off and it will lower my cost for my other transactions so let's get into transaction number two all right so here's my second transaction i picked up two deodorant speed sticks two more garnier shampoos i picked up three big liquid tides and then i pick up two crest toothpaste one tide pods and then the two nivea lotions so here are my coupons i had a three off of two Nivea lotion. I had a four dollar for the Garnier, a two dollar for the Tide Pods, and then the next three three dollar ones are for the bigger Tide Pods. And then I used a fifty cent paper coupon for the Speed Stick. And the rest are digital coupons, CRTs, and my extra care bucks. So I had a five off of thirty five Tide CRT that I went ahead and paired in. I had a three off of two Speed Stick CRT and a three off of ten lotion CRT. And I rolled twenty six dollars and nineteen cents in extra care bucks to lower my out of pocket, bringing my total to. 11.53 before tax. So I'm gonna explain this transaction for you guys as well. So our total was 11.53, but I rolled $26.19 in extra care bucks. So that is my money. So I'm gonna go ahead and add that to the total. So what that brings our actual total for this transaction to 37.72. But you guys, I got some extra care bucks back, of course. So let's get right into it. First, I got back two dollars for purchasing the speed stick deodorant. So I'm gonna go ahead and subtract two. Then I got three dollars in extra care bucks for purchasing two whole blends. I'm gonna subtract three. I got back $10 in extra care bucks for spending 40 on select products. So that was all four of the Tide products. So I'm going to go ahead and subtract 10. And then I got $3 in extra care bucks for purchasing the two Crest toothpaste. So I'm going to subtract three. And then I got back $5 in extra care bucks for purchasing two of the Nivea lotion. So I'm going to subtract five. And then this account started at 2010 in beauty. And I spent more than $10 in this transaction. So that reaches a $30 mark for beauty. I'm going to be getting $3 in beauty bucks within 48 hours. I'm going to go ahead and subtract three. So the final cost for this transaction was just $11.72, which is really not that bad because that really had three big tides. And with my first transaction being a moneymaker, it's going to lower this cost. So let's get on to the last transaction, which is just the cereal. So I went ahead and picked up six cereals priced at $177. So the tag said $177 for two of the plain Cheerios, but they did not ring up for $177, but the manager did ring them up for $8.77 for me which was awesome and sweet of him so then for the coupons I used two $1 off of two paper coupons and then I had a $1 off of two digital coupon and then I used
used a 12 of 8 breakfast cereal tea. So that just left me to pay $6.62 for 6 boxes of cereal. Now let's go ahead and get to final numbers for everything. Alright, so we're going to start off with the cereal transaction being $6.62 plus my second transaction which was $11.72. So I'm going to go ahead and add that. So we are at $18.34. Now I'm going to subtract $6.59 from our money maker on our first transaction. So that brings my total to $11.75. But you guys, I submitted my receipts in two fetch awards and got back a total of $0.11. Cents. Every cent counts, so I'm going to go ahead and subtract $0.11. Cents. All right, you guys, so I'm recording this on my iPhone. I have never done this before and added this in my video. I completely forgot to mention that there were some, I bought a rebates for the Nivea lotion. So after the $0.11 cents from fetch awards, my total was $11.64, and I bought it, you guys. Guys, I got back a total of a dollar and seventy cents back. I got back twenty cents for any receipt and eight dollar fifty for the Nivea lotion, seventy five cents each. So I'm gonna go ahead and subtract a dollar seventy from Ibotta, bringing our final cost, you guys, to just nine dollars and forty five cents for everything, you guys. We got a total of. 31 items so i'm gonna go ahead and divide it 31 so the final cost you can say is nine dollars and 94 cents for all 31 items or just 32 cents per item you guys which is insane so i'm very happy about how this second cvs haul came out and i don't use tide so i'll be able to resell a big tide for just six dollars each and i'll be able to make so much profit off of this i'm very excited to be eating some cheerios that is it for my second cvs haul of this week you guys thank you guys so much for watching and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye